It's your boy. I got my mic, my my snowball set up now. Hopefully my voice doesn't sound like ass. I guess we'll find out. But I figured I'd do something a little different tonight. I got this game. It's called uh, Caves of Cud? Quud? Cud? I don't know. It's a semi-ASCII roguelike. Seems pretty fun. So, yeah, I figured we'd do that to test out the new mic and see how things go. Yeah. Do let me know if my, uh, if my mic sounds like butt, because uh, cause I gotta tweak things, and I've been tweaking it since about 3 o'clock, but I don't know, I, things always change when you go live. So, yeah, but we'll get started with that here in just a sec. Let's fucking go. All right, let me turn this down a touch before I pull it up. Uh, volume mixer, black power, pull it here. We're gonna drop this down to like 25. I have it at 40 right now in my ears, so it's just dropping it down by like a touch. Okay, also gonna just like turn my overall volume down a touch. There we go. Make sure that actually stuck. Yeah, hell yeah, it did. All right. So I know basically nothing about this game. It just seemed like it'd be interesting. And I like kind of semi-ASCII. I like ASCII. I play Dwarf Fortress for fuck's sake. Like, it just doesn't get much more ASCII than that. And I'll do Dwarf Fortress on a stream someday. Assuming my computer doesn't just like fucking catch fire. Which is very possible. The game is like hella CPU heavy, so... And so is streaming, so yeah. But let's do a new game. Um, okay, so we get to create a character. Uh, we can do a weekly challenge. I don't think I want to do that. Let's just make a character. Okay. So we can choose between a mutated human or a true kin. A mutated human has mutations and moderate starting attributes, and a true kin has high starting attributes, can access cybernetics, 20 bonus skill points each level. <laughs> Bonus resistance is based on archaeology of origin. I don't even know what the fuck those words mean. They rebuke robots. Like, be gone, bot. That kind of thing, I guess. I don't know. And then we get 600 reputation with the, the Pewis Templar. 
Um, that seems like the easy mode, not gonna lie. So let's do the not easy mode. Okay, so character creation. All right, we have we have one point on that. How many points do we have? Oh, well, we have like we have like forty four points. Holy shit! Okay, so we have like a lot. Um, so let's see. We have strength, agility, toughness, intelligence, willpower, and ego. So strength. Uh, let's see how effectively you penetrate your opponent's armor with melee attacks. How much damage your melee attacks do, and your abilities resist forced movement. And your carry capacity seems pretty good. Agility uh, determines your accuracy with both melee and ranged weapons and your ability to dodge attacks. Okay. Toughness determines hit points, healing rate, and ability to resist poison and disease. Let's see. Intelligence determines your number of skill points and your ability to examine artifacts. Probably important. Willpower modifies the cooldown of activated abilities, determines your natural or determines your ability to resist mental attacks and modifies your natural healing rate. And then ego is mental mutations, the ability to haggle, and the ability to dominate the wills of other living creatures. Okay. Holy fuck. Um how about we do a let's just start out with like a punchy boy. So I'm gonna do 17 strength. I'm gonna do 17 agility and 17 toughness. Um, okay. Probably should do 17 intelligence also. Or actually, let's do 18 in all of those. And then we're gonna bump this up to 20. We'll bump that up to 20. We'll bump that up to 20. So we won't have good stuff to resist mental attacks. And our healing rate probably won't be as good as it could be. And our haggling and mental mutations are not going to be as great, but this is going to be a... Let's, uh, let's put this up to 22. Yeah, that seems okay for like a strength. It's probably too balanced, honestly, but I think that's going to be okay. Let's choose mutations. What the fuck is this? Okay. Um, expand. We can be a chimera. We only manifest physical mutations. That seems good. So let's uh, add that. Unstable. Oh, okay, we have 11 points. Okay. Unstable genome. Gain an extra mutation, but doesn't manifest right away. When you gain a level, there's a 33% chance that your genome destabilizes, and you get to choose from three random mutations. That could be good. Let's look at physical mutations. Okay, adrenal control. Uh, we can. Increase our body's adrenaline flow for 20 rounds. We gain plus 10 quickness and other physical mutations gain plus 1 rank. Okay. Beak. We get, uh... <laughs> we get plus 1 ego and 200 reputation with birds. I kind of like that. Burrowing claws. Uh, 4 successful attacks to dig through a wall. Claw penetration versus walls is good. Walls are also a short blade class natural weapon that deal 1d2 base damage to non walls, so up to 2 damage per swipe, okay? Carapace. We get, uh, plus, what the fuck is AV and DV? Attack value, defense value? It's the only thing I can think. You tighten your carapace to receive double the AV bonus at a 2 DV penalty as long as you stand still. That doesn't. I don't know what that quite does. Corrosive gas generation. Release a burst of corros corrosive gas around yourself. Okay. Double muscled. <laughs> Possessed of hulking strength. We get plus two to strength. 50% chance. 15, sorry, percent chance to daze your opponent. That seems good. Let's get that. Uh, electrical generation. We can accrue electrical charge and then we can discharge it to deal damage. EM pulse. Can generate an EMP electromagnetic pulse that disables a nearby artifacts and machines. Could be good. Flame fucking flame ray and a freeze ray. So we can do up to five damage per. Okay, interesting. Heightened hearing can detect the presence of creatures within a radius of five, and we have a chance to identify. Term gifted with tremendous speed could be good. What's up? How's my mic sound? I gotta. I showed you the picture. I'm quiet. Oh. Oh no. Hang on. 
I turned the gain way down because I was like blowing the microphone out, but I could probably fix that. So let's uh let me crank the gain up a touch to like seven. Is that better? Because I'm trying not to blow my mic out. And I turn the I turn the game audio way the fuck down so I don't get blown out by the game, because that has happened a lot in the past, and I'm not trying to do that. Okay, multiple arms. We can get extra arms. That's sick. Multiple legs. Is that at 25 right now? It's up to 55. What the fuck? See, that's the weird thing. So my my mic. Sorry, I'm popping out of the game real quiet all the time. So I don't know what it is. Like my my microphone is like as high as it'll go. It could just be that like I'm not right up in the mic. But, and like I said, I turned the game down on purpose so that it doesn't blow my, my voice out. But like, I had the gain up to where I had it for my headset and like, all my settings. I don't know. Uh, I don't really have any settings that make me quiet though. Like, I have a shitload of gain. Blame me if you want. Yeah, blame him. It's his fault. <laughs> That's easier. Night vision. Uh, see in the dark. Seems pretty obvious. <laughs> can phase through solid objects could be good we can replenish myself by absorbing sunlight that seems good that seems really good let's do that let me add that quills so we might be able to we have 300 quills and we might expel 10% in a burst around myself could be good we have Wolverine ass healing, sleep gas, slime glands, cover an area with slime, spinnerets. We could be a spider. We could have venom. Is this? Can I scroll down? No. Okay. Paralyzing venom, poisoning venom, thick fur. Hmm. Triple jointed. Could be good. All of these could be really good, to be honest. I have no clue. Two hearts could be could be real good, actually. Wings, I can fly. Can travel over land two times speed. Forty percent chance, forty percent reduced chance of becoming lost. While outside, may fly. Can't be hit in melee if we're flying. We have a five percent chance of just fucking dropping out of the sky. 20% move speed while sprinting. That seems pretty fucking good, not gonna lie. And that's about the extent of... Okay, so I have two points. Let's take a beak so I can be a bird man with... I can be a real buff fucking bird man with either thick fur, slime glands, or night vision. I'm gonna go with night vision. It seems like the best choice here. Kind of mental... Okay. Wow. Cold-blooded, electromagnetic impulse. Involuntarily release electromagnetic pulses, deactivating robots and artifacts around yourself? That doesn't seem like a bad thing. Hooks for feet. Can't wear shoes. Well, I'm going to be flying, so that may not be the worst thing in the world. Or if you spend a mutation point, the next mutation point you gain will be spent randomly. Okay. Nearsighted, I can only see a radius up to 10. Lack of developed sense of pain, you only know your general state. Oh no, fuck that, I like knowing how many hit points I have. Spontaneously erupt into flames, it seems bad. Okay, so there's not really this that many physical defects, what about mental defects? Oh, I can't even take those, it looks like, so... Okay, let's collapse that. Um... Let's see if there's anything... What is up here that would be good to have? Regeneration would probably be good. Yeah, so I need four points. And hooks for feet is probably fine. So we're going to take that. We're going to take regeneration. Let's continue. What do I get a... Oh, I get to choose a class. Or calling. Okay. Apostle. Arcanaut. Short blade tinkering. That could be good. Graybeard. No, I want to be a strong boy. Or a fast, dodgy boy. I don't know. Marauder. 
Ooh, that bumps me up a bunch. Okay. Pilgrim. Self-discipline, okay. Nomad. Scholar, tinker, scholar. It's not gonna be something I want. Nor is tinker, tinkerer. Long blade shield, bow and rifle, pistol, and plus 300 reputation with fellowship of wardens. Okay. I like that. We're gonna be a birdman, a birdman warden, with a sword, shield, and like a gun. Is that is that correct? Let's say this character, uh, Harvey Birdman. Okay. Uh, space. Recommended for new players. Yeah, that's probably my best bet then. So let's go there. Um, yes. What is my name? Uh, my name is going to be, again, Harvey Birdman. I like how the quote here is just, Graaaaaaa. Yes, that's correct. You embark for the caves of Quid. Holy shit, okay. 21st of whatever the fuck that says. Uh, you arrive in the desert. You arrive at the oasis hamlet of Joppa. Along the far rim of, uh, Mograyi. Great Salt Desert. All around you are moisture farmers. All around you, moisture farmers tend to the groves of Viridian Waterbine. Their huts rot from rock salt and brine stalk. On the horizon, cuds jungles strangle chrome steeples and rusted archways to the earth. Further and beyond, the fabled spindle rises above the fray and pierces the cloud ribbon sky. Press space and press F1 for help. Okay. Ten things you should do when you start to play. Switch to alternate key set if you don't have a numpad. I have a numpad, so I'm good. Hot key your activated abilities. Okay, so what activated abilities do I have? I have this, it looks like. Map key. Uh, shield slam is going to be on L. Oh no. Shield slam is going to be on 2? No. Shield slam is going to be on J. God fucking damn it. S? Okay. Mark target, sprint. We should probably make a sprint key for Z. Make camp. Uh, we'll make camp one. Mark target. I don't know what that does, but we'll make it T for target. No. We'll make it E. No. We'll make it R. No. We'll make it Q. No. We'll make it A. Fucking Christ. Plus two, three DV while wielding a long blade. Okay, so aggressive stance is gonna be up. Why is everything like fucking bound? Fly is gonna be on ta damn it. Fly is gonna be on all mm, this. <laughs> and then Basque will be on that. Cool. Okay, F1. Scroll through the character member menus. Press X to view your character sheet. I to view your inventory. E for your equipment. Q for quests. K for tinkering. Okay, look at things by pressing L. Interact with objects by pressing space. Press Alt for additional information. And a sidebar view you like. That is some Dwarf Fortress ass shit. Get acquainted with common key mappings. So it's that. Walk upstairs and walk downstairs. Okay. Penetration value represents the armor value that this weapon will usually penetrate with ease. Okay, so the, the arrow with the 4 is my penetration and the 1d4 is my damage. That makes sense, okay. Pieces of armor have an army value and a dodge value. The armor value is added to your character's armor. And then the dodge value is added to the dodge. That makes sense. Speak with Tam, the Dromad Merchant. Okay, so, so I have a bunch of stuff, um, yeah, I like that because it tells me what the fuck's going on. Okay, so, are you Tam? Is he, is he Tam? How the fuck did it tell me to, how the fuck did it tell me to talk to this boy? Southeastern corner, press tab to trade with him. So who are you? Warden Yalrig. Yalrig. A 
I wonder if there's uh, options to change the color scheme. Because... Not that I don't like the color scheme, but I would like the color scheme better if it wasn't this green. I'll get... Probably not, I'm guessing. User interface. F1 for take all instead of tab. No, I guess not. Okay. Yeah, okay. So, escape. This is gonna be fine. So he's in the southeastern corner. Mehmet. Uh, let's trade, buddy. You have a vine wafer, and I have a bunch of stuff. I can't even wear the leather moccasins. So, let's pick that. And let's offer it to him. Cool. So I've got... Wow, he's selling that for a huge fucking markup. What an asshole. Okay. That's by water vine. Southeastern corner. This is southeast, yeah? Is this... Just the man? No. Oh, it is Tam. Okay. I'm Harvey Birdman. Who are you? Uh... So he's Tam. Do you live here? Yeah, this is home. Since I walked the Mogri Yi, like so many of my brethren, but upon meeting Elder... I, fuck, this is this game's trying to make me say all kinds of words I don't know how to say. Um, okay. What kind of creature are you? I'm a Dromad, a Salt Strider. People have walked the salt for thousands of years, meeting every creature that lives and thinks. You will not find better, more resourceful traders than all of Cud than we. Okay. Nice to meet you, bud. So can I, like, just, like... Okay, I didn't want to bask, but... Starts metabolizing the meal, getting the following effect for the rest of the day. Plus 30% to natural healing rate, plus 15 quickness. I want it to fly. Okay, you've gained the activated ability Swoop. So we should probably... Bind Swoop... Uh, to 9. So I can fly. I am flying now. Let's land. And talk to him. Mehmet. I'm in search for work. Or search of work. Some critters are eating the water vine. Farouk claims he saw one slinking around the vine patch. Pale white, eight legs, and the ear splitting wine. Oh, great. So it's a big spider. Bit of red dirt in the water vine pool. Same we find in the soil. Nearby cave to the north we call Red Rock. Travel to Red Rock and kill as many of them as you can. Bring back the corpse of one. Yeah, sure. So we said north. So let's go north. How do I... You can go to the world map by pressing minus on the numpad. Okay. So... I don't know where the fuck I'm going. And I'm kind of afraid because I can't see shit. So he said red rock, right? You're hungry. Oh, shit. Um... Eh? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Uh, no. How do I get back out of the map? How do I get out of the map? Oh. Would you like to walk to the nearest stairway up? Yeah, sure. There are no stairways. Nothing to take. How do I get out of this? <laughs> okay. So this is Red Rock. Okay. So how do I make camp again? Key mapping? Didn't I, didn't I bind this? Uh, A. The camp is D1, so... I'm gonna camp. Pass by a campfire. I'm gonna whip up a meal. Gather whatever you can find for your meal. Foam, foam creep flake, diaphanous wing, equimax hair. Okay. That seems disgusting. Eat the meal. Great. So it's dark as fuck outside, basically. Okay, so we good. We good. Nothing going on here. I'm guessing that this is the staircase down into the cave. So yes. Oh, there are things. Uh, let's uh, let's fly. I can't fly underground. Oh. Snapjaw scavenger refuses to speak to you. Okay, so this is a snapjaw scavenger. He's got a bite. He's hostile as fuck. All right, so let's shield slam this bitch, and then how do I just like attack? How do, I, how do I attack? Melee attack nearest enemy is shift A. I think I killed them. Yes, I shield slammed the ever-loving fuck out of 
this guy, and then I killed this one. He had a bronze two-handed sword. Can I take this stuff? Take. How do I take it? How do I take it? Oh god. Key mappings, quick, help me. Get is G. I want that sword, and I want the dagger, and the buckler too, fuck it, why not? So what do I have equipped in my left hand? I don't have... I have... Okay, I have an iron long sword in my right hand, and an iron buckler on my right arm. In my left arm, I have nothing. So let's put the wooden buckler on. And then I'm going to keep the torch, because it seems like a good idea. Okay, okay, I kind of see where this is going. Oh, there's a guy. Oh, he's fucking dead, too. Alright. So there's some water. Salty water. And I'm dripping water behind me. Oh, fuck. Okay. Killed them. What do they got? Witchwood wreath? That's, uh... That's, uh, shit. Uh, space get. Space get. What is my, like, equipment? Okay, I can carry 390 pounds. What does this guy have? Bronze two-handed sword. Probably not worth taking. Bronze mace. Let's get that. Let's get the buckler. Okay. Can't fly underground. Which kind of sucks. Oh shit, is that like a- what the fuck is that? Is that a bear? It's a bear. Oh god, okay. Bear's gonna fucking kill me. Yeah, the bear's gonna- yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> okay. So we can start a new game. <laughs> Let's just go back to playing Harvey Bird, man. Holy fuck. Let's go. Let's go. It's gonna be Harvey Birdman again. Birdman 2. <laughs> Good to know, don't fight bears. Okay. Uh, no. That's not what I wanted to do. Current location. This is what I want, okay. Yeah, let's leave this for now. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. Fuck, I need to talk to this man. Search at work. I'll do as you ask. Let's go up to the menu. And he said Red Rock. So, right here. Okay. Birdman is dead long with Birdman. Yeah. Listen, I don't know what I'm doing in this game. I just, I literally, I bought this like an hour ago and I started it up to make sure that it would stream before, um, before streaming like that was that was it i have no fucking clue what i'm doing it's ascii as fuck though with some graphics and i'm cool with that because i like ascii games like it makes me want to play dwarf fortress honestly but uh dwarf fortress would probably be boring as fuck to watch to be fair this is probably not that interesting to watch either but eh, it is what it is, is what i'm playing for now i hear monkeys i don't know how to feel this way no Wait, I can fly. It's really pretty. You and I have different opinions on pretty. Can't. Oh, I basket. Okay. I want to fly. Yes. Because I want to be able to fly over and around things. There's a goat. So I need to find the entrance to this fucking cave. I got, I got knocked down. <laughs> I didn't lose any health. So I'm going to go west. Outskirts Red Rock surface. So it's got to be here, right? This is specifically Red Rock. So I've got to find the staircase down. Man, this is some threatening fucking music for like nothing going on. Well, I'd have thought it had been up here, but there's. Oh, it is. Okay, so let's land. That's not. Yeah, not what I wanted to do. Oh, I'm, I wasn't flying to begin with. Uh, okay. We want to go down. Kill this man. Oh, wait, I did. I just killed him. I just straight up murdered him. Oh, and there's another one. Yeah, he's dead. I got a critical hit on him. Oh, he got a critical hit on me. Holy shit. Um, tab? No. It's space. Black robes. Iron battle axe? Let's take that. What is hitting me? Seed spitting vine? 
Are you fucking joking me right now? Get the fuck out of here. The seed spitting vine is killing me. <laughs> I'm gonna make camp. One. Let's uh let's eat some food. 14% max HP plus 30 the natural healing rate. So let me just like walk around, I guess, and get my health back, because the seed spitting vine was fucking me up. Get my health back, okay, get my health back. Alright, we're good. I'm gonna go down. Uh I don't want any of that. Oh, I wanted to see what What is my equipment? The iron longsword is six penetration, one d4 damage. And so how do I switch weapons? Inventory? The iron battle axe is six penetration, one d2 plus one damage. So it's always gonna do a minimum of two damage and a maximum of three. This can do a minimum of one damage and a maximum of four. So it seems like keeping my sword would be the best idea for now. Okay, well, let's go. F where'd the vine go? Doesn't really matter, I guess. Okay, dog is dead. Hand axe, leather moccasins, can't wear them. Bronze battle axe. I think iron's probably better. Pass by a chest. Shotgun shells? Holy fuck. Take all that. Look at my inventory. What did I get? A masterwork short bow? What, am I gonna put the shotgun shells in the fucking bow? Like, of course not. That'd be cool, though. Okay, what's over here? There's a camp. Uh, I don't really need to do anything with the camp. Oh, I have. I'm like way almost overweight. There's a bat. I can trade with the bat? The bat has nothing to trade. Live and drink. Later, guy. Bat was my friend. Put the shotgun shells in the bow? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if I can. I probably can't do that. That's stupid. It has to work short bow. Like, it's empty. So how do I... Equip auto. So did that? No, it didn't. Okay, I figured, but it's worth a try. Snapjaw hunter? Excuse me? What the fuck? Is the bat hitting me? Like, does the bat want to die? He had a short bow on him, but he doesn't have any arrows, so it's pointless. Bronze dagger. Okay, none of that's really worth it. That's why some campfire remains. Oh, good arrows! Fucking equip that shit. And a water skin, which we can get, because water is important, I assume. Okay, that guy's dead. Studded leather armor. Oh boy. Um, get. Go to my inventory. And equip. Your leather armor was unequipped. Oh, it does do more though, right? Like it's three. Three with a minus two? What does that mean? Look. Show effects. No active effects. I don't know what the minus two means. Oh, it's probably like minus two damage or something. I don't know. Some, what, some salt water? Oh, fuck. He's dead. Oh, there's another one. He's dead too. Auto got beaded bracelet. I'm still trying to figure out how to how to like play this game. <laughs> I took his beaded bracelet. What does it do exactly? Can I what is okay, you. Look. These beads were skillfully dyed and strung together by a hillside native. Okay. So show effects, no active effects. I guess it's just a treasure. Oh what did the fucking wall attack me? The bat attacked the wall for me. Jilted lover. Interesting. Oh, it's the fucking plant. The plant's dead. Witchwood wreath, bronze longsword. Ashes. So, did these... I don't know if the snapjaw is like what I'm looking for. It's probably not. Okay. So I need to go down again, most likely. Let's go. There's another treasure chest. Vine wafer and another beaded bristle. Let's take all. 
Um, okay, let me look at my skills. But uh, how do I s use my bow? Because my man's is like running away. I've gained a level. Six hit points, 82 skill points. What the fuck? How do I level up? Uh, okay, let's space. No, it's shit. There's something hitting me. Okay, I need to get the fuck because I'm getting like butt murdered out here. Go up, <laughs> quick, quick, go up. I already have a camp nearby. Oh, right here. We'll have a meal. Okay, I need to like regen my health. Also, let's look at the key mappings and see where like the level up screen is. Open skills and powers. Okay, it's a P. I have 82 skill points remaining. Oh, okay, I see things cost like 50 skill points. Okay, that makes sense. Bow and rifle. Steady hands, draw a bead. Kickback. Whenever you fire a two-handed weapon at a target in melee range, you attempt to kick the target backwards. Okay, so I'll like kick them and shoot them. Interesting. I don't have enough for any of that. I don't have a pistol. So basically, I don't have enough, like... The only thing I really have enough points for is, like, making camp. And I need 15 intelligence to really do any of this, it looks like. At least. Acrobatics? I am skilled at acrobatics. You're skilled with axes. Oh, this is just, like, giving me skill with things. Interesting. Okay. So what does acrobatics do? Let's get it. I have a plus five bonus to my DV when flinching away from missile attacks. Okay. Uh, well, didn't I get some? I got mutation points. I need four mutation points to buy a new mutation. Okay. All right, well, let's just like let my health regenerate quick. I'm just gonna dance around, dancing all day. Dancing all day. All right, let's get the foot. So I should be able to fire my, my, bow by hitting F and then hitting space. F space. F space. Space. F space. I got him. Okay. That's how you do that. I auto got the wooden arrows. How do I... God. Okay. Here we go. So he had... No. There's not really shit here for me, is there? A leather cap. That could be good. No. I want to get this specifically. Let's go to my inventory and equip the leather cap. Okay. Why do I see my defense value? I have four defense value, I guess that's what that means. Four attack value, four defense value, 330 XP. What is this? Spotted shag spook? Shag spook even. Holy fuck. Powder coats the skin on the spots of its colossal cap. Its stalk is trunk-like. It takes pigment from the sap that weeps nearby. Okay. Uh, let's open this chest. I'm going to take the arrows. Get the arrows. A weird artifact. Examine. You made some progress understanding the electro bow. Excuse me? Electro bow? Okay. 10 penetration, 1d6, small trinket. Okay. Oh, it is just straight up an electro bow. Fucking equip that shit. And a cracked lens. Look. It's a small piece of scrap. Okay. Well, I probably don't want that. Wait, I saw a weird artifact. Hold up. I'm not... Cr oh, I probably took it. I really took it is what happened. Um, copper nugget. Where did it go? Did I not take it? Masterwork short bow. Burnt capacitor. Weird artifact. Here it is. Uh, examine. Made some progress understanding the electrified bronze battle axe. 5 penetration, 1d2 damage. No cell. Okay. Well, that's cool. It's blocked by a shag spook. Okay. 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 This is good. Go down. 
Okay, so first of all, shoot my man with the Electro, but holy fuck, 10 damage on that man. Oh, that was the thing I needed to kill. Gained a level. Oh, that's Skunk. The Skunk is stinky. Wait, no, I don't want to mark that. I want it. F. And I want to shoot the skunk. Because I'm, like, stinky now. I don't understand how to, how to accurately do this. Got him. Okay. There's so many fucking enemies. Also... Do I not have a fucking melee weapon? I have a melee weapon attack equipped. Why can't I hit the man with the melee weapon? I mean, I'll shoot him with the fucking electro, like, electro bow. That's fine. I want to get the corpse of... Oh, God. Cave spider. Um, let's take it. Let's get, the f let's get the fucking chest and let's get the fuck out of here. Iron dagger. Okay, that's... I don't care. Let's go up. My health is fine. I'm just stinky. Okay, X for this. I have two mutation points, one attribute point. Oh, I have an attribute point even, okay. Uh, put it in agility, yes, okay. And then P for skills. Okay, okay. So I got some acrobatic stuff earlier. Didn't I? Where the fuck is it? What the fuck? Long blade. Oh, wait, here it is. Acrobatic swift reflexes. Kickback, 19 strength. Okay. So here's where I'm confused. If I'm... If I am... Firing a melee weapon, or firing a missile weapon... I just want to, like, attack. Like, melee attack. Melee attack nearest enemy. But that's... Not... Auto attack in melee... A. I guess there's nothing to auto attack. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. We're, we we succeeded in our mission. We're gonna bring the man his cave spider corpse that I've su sufficiently destroyed with the fucking electro bow. And we're gonna sell some of the stuff we have because I've got a lot of it. It's a fucking plant. Well, he's dead now. <laughs> That's so stupid. Wide brim hat. Okay. I gotta figure out how the fuck, okay, as I say, I gotta figure out how the fuck to get out of here now, but it should be right here. Yes, okay. Map. Uh, big map. I need to go back down to town. Oh, no, go up. And talk to the man. And tidings for Red Rock. Oh. Okay, my reputation increased with them to minus 40, but my reputation with the oozes decreased and I'm despised by oozes. Okay. Interesting. Did I not bring the fucking corpse back with me? Did I forget to grab the spider corpse? No, I got it. So. Where's my quest log? Travel to Red Rock, find the critters, get a critter corpse. I thought I did do that. Okay, fine. Okay. Wanderer, orphan of salt, hear me. To the north and the west, through the great salt desert, the six day stilt splits the earth in two. Seek there the grandeur of Shekinah. Shekinah? First among fathers, release yourself from the burden that Chrome bears on your sickly flesh. Sure, whatever you say, buddy. Um, let's go... I'm still stinky. Let's go over here and talk to our good buddy. And, uh... Let's... How do I trade? You can't even trade with them. It's like tab to trade, right? Isn't that crazy? But I just have to find somebody to trade with. Like, can I trade with this man? Can I 
trade with this man. No. No. Okay. Let's let's see what I can do, okay? What does the help tell me? Press tab to trade with him. You'll be able to stock up on brace basic provisions. So if I come over here and I press tab, it doesn't do anything but open my fucking inventory. Oh, because, okay, you have to be in the menu. Okay, I see, I see, I see. He doesn't want the ammo. He will take the black robes. He will take the leather armor. He'll take my moccasins. He'll take, uh... My electrified bonds, bronze battle axe, the iron battle axe. The slender bronze dagger. Does he actually, he is, hang on. Let's let's go trade with like this guy. I don't know what. Okay, I don't understand quite how this works. He has one hundred and twenty dollars. Okay, that's what I need to know. So trade this, trade that, trade this, trade the weapons, trade the short. But no, keep the short bow. I might need it. Trade the capacitor. Ooh, trade that and this. Okay, so he gave me a shitload of water for that. Which is good. He's got some weird artifacts, but they're too expensive. He's got a musket. It's too expensive. Okay. So I need to... I guess I didn't... complete the quest. So let's go back. Let's, um... How do I bask? I need sunlight to bask in. Okay, let's go down. Now nah, it was up. Let's go down. Let's go back down and continue exploring then, because I thought I was done, but I guess I'm not. But that was the thing I needed. They said it was like a white thing with eight legs and it screeched. Well, that was a white thing with eight legs and it screeched, so. Okay. We good. We good. Everything is good. Everything is fine. That is not fine. Okay, can I not attack if I have, like, I have a buckler equipped. So why can't I hit him? I mean, I fucking, like, murder him with the bow, but that's not what I want to do. So, what the fuck? Maybe if I... What is this? What is this? Beetle bum. Okay. Oh! Oh no! He's dead now, friend. I got him. Four skin gloves. I probably want those. Uh... E. Tab. Oh, Jesus. Space. Okay. Uh, let's take the gloves. And then let's equip the gloves. Worn on hands, or skin gloves. Okay, cool. My feet are hooks, doesn't really matter. How many arrows do I have? <laughs> Probably be good to know. Or does it just use electricity? Oh fuck, I didn't think about that. Set of leather armor, it's already what I'm wearing. Okay. Feathered wooden buckler. It's probably worth some money. Okay, okay. What is that? Whomst is this? Whomst is this? This is a giant centipede. Quickly. Shock him. He's dead now. Okay. I kind of understand. I just wish I knew how to, like, melee attack, because I have a melee weapon. And so let's see, can I combat? Okay, melee combat. Simply move in the direction of the opponent to attack something else. Oh, so I just need to like move into him? Missile combat. So maybe I'll try that next time I get into a fight. I'll just try to like finish the step, find the critters. 
I've gained a level. Okay. I have 171 skill points. Which, okay, so I can jump. I can get a plus two bonus to my DV. I can get some different stuff. Okay, you fire at a marked target for each penetration on for each penetration on each shot that hits, your target bleeds one point of damage per round. Okay, surefire, you fire at a marked target with no accuracy penalty. Okay. Okay. What was okay? Dual wield is expensive. What is this? Gershling? He is hostile as fuck. I died. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Fuck. Okay. That was fine. Let's just, uh, let's create a new character. Let's make another mutated human. Fuck, dude. Make it fucking Trukin, then. Why not? I'm gonna put a bunch into strength. How many birdmen are you gonna kill? Enough is how many. Do 20 strength, 20 agility, 20 toughness. I still have 8 points, so we're gonna do 24 strength. We're gonna be a strong boy. I get to be in a cast. Okay. Horticulturist. Plus three to intelligence. No. Axe, bow, and rifle. Priest of all sons. Plus three to ego. I want something with strength. So let's find one. Okay. Praetorian. Strength, toughness, and willpower. Cold resistance. This is roughly the same thing I already was. Be a eunuch, which I'm good. Plus three strength, 15 heat resistance. This reminds me of the time I took off my top and got killed by Greg Kinner. Kinner? Why do I feel like I know what you're talking about, but I can't remember off the top of my head what it is? Ooh, this lets me dual wield. I'll do that. Oh, I get cybernetic implants. Hell yeah. Okay. Toy store? I still have no fucking idea what you're talking about. You're gonna have to be more specific. <laughs> Thermal insulation. Thermal insulation, thermal insulation. Optic bio opt optical bioscanner. Little Dr. Tran video. Oh fuck, I forgot about Dr. Tran. Oh there's a fucking um Oh, there was one I used to watch all the time and I can't remember what it was. Holy shit. I dare you forget about the Dr. Tran and his hot dickings. Yeah, no, I remember that vaguely. I remember the one where they were talking about tits too. It was like a store named Tits. Gain access to precise hit point, armor, and dodge value. Oh, it's a dodge value. Armor and dodge value. Okay, AV and DV. Gotcha. Optical techno scanner. Automatically identify your artifacts, but that's for robotic creatures. Night vision. How many license points do I have, I guess is what I want to know. Let's get the optical bioscanner. Oh, that's the- I can only get one. Well, that's what I took, so... Let's go. <laughs> what is my name? Let's see, I'm a... I'm a cyborg. I'm gonna be Cyclops, because he's got the visor. Cyclops. <laughs> okay. So Cyclops has a visor. I have a visor. It makes sense. Alright, let's go. That's not what I wanted to do. Let's go. Let's go talk to the man. Uh, I'm in search for work. I'll do as you ask. Alright, I'm gonna go do this fucking quest, goddammit. Like... I gotta know how to do it. Also, I have some other stuff, so I need to bind that. 
Um, Review Robot will be nine. Uh, nine. Flurry will be on eight. Okay. 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 There's the staircase. I am getting trapped in something. Uh, oh, I'm blind. I'm like blind as fuck over here. Is it because it's dark? Is that why? What do I have in my inventory? I have a chem cell and a solar cell. Do I have any weapons? I have a steel axe and a potter's knife. For weapons. Don't you touch my suspend- Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Wasn't there, like, the same video where he's like, Drive your SUV down here and I will kick you in the dick! Yeah. <laughs> we will not run out of bricks! And something about, like, hitting your baby with a brick? Yeah, no, I remember. I, I, it's been a long fucking time, but I remember. Kick you in the dick and I'll drop you like a pussy! Pussy! <laughs> Look at my little teeth! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's been so long. I want to go... Did I go down? I went down. It is dark as a motherfucker in here. I don't see sh jack fucking shit. How do I equip a torch? Like, my man, I can't see. Equip that shit. My steel hand axe was unequipped. I want my steel hand axe to be equipped in my left hand. Remove. Hand axe. Wait, what does more damage? 7 and 1d4, so the potter's knife is better. Okay. Okay, I can fucking see now. And I can see that I'm getting my fucking shit beat. Hand axe. Okay, let's go down. There are hostiles nearby. Then I'm gonna fucking die. I have no clue what's even going on. <laughs> can I make a camp? Like, he's got a bow, but I think I already have a... I don't have a missile weapon equipped. I have a thrown weapon. I can throw a fucking stun gas grenade. I don't have any missile weapons, so I guess let's take his missile weapon. Uh, take. Okay. Furs. I don't know what I have equipped, so we'll get it and we'll look at my equipment. And my body have a woven tunic. I wish I could see, like. So it's two and one. This is one and two, so it's. What's going on, Art Man? Yeah, I, I, I saw the video. That's why I bought this. <laughs> Holy fuck, I have no clue what I'm doing um, other than just getting my shit pushed in. Free marketing? Yeah. Yeah, no, it is. I mean, hey, it worked for me. I fucking bought it. It looked good. Uh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Okay, hang on. Hang on, weird artifact. Here it is. Two drams of fresh water. Is that what it's going to cost me? Yeah, let's do it. Recycling ring mail. Okay. Oh, wait. It collects... things. Okay. I see. And then I have... I guess it's three armor value and two dodge value? I have pretty decent dodge. Holy shit. Okay, 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 okay. Small bowler. There's a guy up there. I've seen, I seen you. Iron long sword. Six penetration, 1d4. I think my weapon does seven penetration in 1d4. Yeah, 1d4 plus one, so it's better. Listen here. Auto got bandage, sturdy quilted shawl. Let's, let's equip it. Yeah. There's a bat. Can I, can I speak? Oh. I went to... It's too busy in hand-to-hand -hand combat to have a conversation with me. Okay. Well, I think the bat died. Something is shooting at me. Snapjaw Hunter. Oh, there he is. Okay. Cool. Painted Iron Mace. It does just straight up two damage. But it's painted, so that'll be good to take. Okay, 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 okay. No, no, no. Wooden arrows, we want to take those. Equip those. I don't have a missile weapon equipped that uses... What the fuck? Equip the bow. Get the arrows. Alright, let's go. 
I got the, okay, I got the arrows. Why am I green? Why am I green? Quenched and hungry. I'm hungry, okay, so I need to make a camp. Uh, which is this button? Do I don't even have the ability to make camp, do I? I sure as fuck don't. Okay. I'm just gonna be hungry, it's fine. Oh fuck, there's a wall there. Uh oh, it's a thing. Die. <laughs> oh, this is I I leveled up. Okay. I have 78 SP. I need a hundred to make a camp. Oh fuck. Okay. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. This is I gain access to two stances. You don't have skill associated with that power. Would you like to purchase the required skill? I need long blade proficiency. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's look at my character. X, there we go. 78 skill points, zero attribute points, and I don't get mutation points as a, a thick boy. <laughs> Truekin, that's what they're called. Holy fuck. How much? I have 15 health. I have 10 health. I have 7 health. I have 4 health. I'm about to die. There are so many of them. There are so many of them. I'm dead. <laughs> okay. I feel like I survived better when I was playing as Harvey Birdman, to be honest. So do I have, I have Harvey Birdman and that's it. Maybe I, okay, maybe I need to rethink what I'm doing here. So I want to go ego. I want to be a, like a magic boy. Ego intelligence. Uh, we still want toughness because we still want to have health. Uh, willpower, activated abilities, determined your ability. Yeah, okay, let's get that up to 20. And then let's boost ego to 21. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So we want morphotypes. We want to be an esper. No, 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 no. We want to be an esper. We don't give a shit about physical mutations or physical defects. Who the fuck cares about that bullshit? Okay. Beguiling. I can make somebody serve me. I can cause plants to grow, hindering my enemies. I can gain vision of a nearby area. I can confuse the fuck out of people. I can chill an area with my mind. I can disintegrate nearby matter. Okay. I'm exhausted for three, three rounds after using this power, so that's like, shit is on top of me, I need to kill it quick. You garot, you garo, garot, an adjacent creature's mind and control its actions while your own body lies dormant. Okay, so basically I can, I can mind fuck people and control them. I can ego project. Augments one physical attribute by an amount equal to twice your ego bonus. Okay. I can make a force bubble. Seems like it could be pretty good. I fire four missile weapons through the force field. Okay. I can do a force wall. I can kindle. I can light a small fire with my mind. Light manipulation. I can produce ambient light. You may focus light into a laser beam. Okay. Mass mind. Tap in the aggregate mine and steal power from other espers. Uh, you know I'm gonna get pyrokinesis. Like, that's already... Already... It's not even in question. Still. Reflect mental attacks. Appear into the near future. You may activate this power and then later revert to the point in time when you activated it. So basically, like... I can rewind time, essentially. Psychometry. You can read the history of artifacts by touching them, learning what they do and how they're made. You can identify artifacts to the complexity tier 4. Learn how to construct them. Okay. Pyrokinesis is to heat a nearby area with your mind. So it does increasing damage over time. And has a 50 round cooldown, but you know I'm going to take it. Because pyrokinesis, come on. You can sense other mental mutants. Sunder the space-time, sending things careening through a tear in the cosmic fabric. It's got a 500 round cooldown. I can enter the vortex to teleport, and I get 200 reputation with highly entropic beings. Okay. 
I can invoke a concussive force in a nearby area, throwing enemies back and stunning them. Creatures that are pushed away from the center of the blast, stunned and dealt crushing damage in up to three increments. And it's a 1d3 increment per increment, okay. So under mine, I can leave them in pain. Up to 10 rounds, you engage in psychic combat with an opponent, dealing damage each round. Taking any action other than passing the turn will break the connection. Okay, so basically as long as I'm scanning their... Just fucking their mind, they, they take damage, okay. I can bond with a nearby creature and leech its life force. Yeah, let's get that. I'm gonna be Dracula. Telepathy, communicate with others. Much time, much less time to issue orders to companions. Well, I haven't had, I haven't had any fucking companions because I suck. Teleport, teleport, teleport. Okay. Time dilation. It slows creatures down. Okay, cool. Disintegration. You disintegrate nearby matter. You're exhausted for three rounds. I'm gonna take that also. Um, amnesia says I forget things and places. Whenever you learn a new secret, there's a small chance you forget a secret. Blinking tick, you tell about you teleport about about uncontrollably. Okay, that seems annoying. Befuddled by technical technological complexity, you're much worse at examining artifacts. No, fuck that. Evil twin. A parallel version of yourself travels through space and time to destroy you. Okay. Involuntarily fall asleep. Can't wear hats or helmets. Uh, I'm already not able to wear Oh no, I'm not not able to wear boots because I didn't take bird feed. Okay. Willf willful acts sometimes dent space-time. You use an activated ability, there's a small chance your focus slips and you dent space-time in a local region called... Okay. Okay. 50 reputation minus 50 reputation with every faction. Let's do the hats. Fuck it. No, you know what? I don't want to take any defects, actually. I'm just going to keep it as is. We want to be something that gives me ego or willpower or something. Cudgel, plus 100 reputation with bears. Sick. Go to pistol. Okay, willpower. I can tinker. I could be a fucking engineer. Lay mine, set bomb, disassemble, repair. Okay, warden, water merchant. To a reputation of water barons. Okay. Okay. Let's um save. We're gonna name this uh uh Tor Bjorn Tor shit. I don't remember this one. Tor Bjorn. Tor Bjorn. Tor Bjorn Dracula. <laughs> Joppa. I think I didn't actually save it. I think I just. Oh no. Uh, Alucard and B O R N R O B J R O T. Yeah. No, I got that backwards. J B R O T. <laughs> it's Dracula backwards. <laughs> okay, let's try again. I'm caring too much to move? It fucking excuse me? What the fuck? Okay. Well, I gotta drop something. The question is, what? I need to drop nine pounds worth of stuff. What do I have equipped? Jewel encrusted chain mail. Excuse me. Hulk honey injector? Yeah, I have no clue what that does. Let's see. Hulk honey. Uh, and look. Slender crystalline disc containing blueprints creates Hulk honey injector. Used to deliver various tonics directly to the bloodstream. So, can I learn it? Oh, so I can just get rid of this shit. Okay, that's good. Well, I still need to get rid of eight things. I have so much less carry weight. Holy fuck. So, oh shit, pull my fucking headphones out of my ears. Uh, is there- there's like a tinker menu, right? Oh wait, tinker. Where's the tinker menu at? 
open tinkering is K. So I can build a whole honey injector. And that's all I can build. Okay. I still can't move. <laughs> Equip. Equip. I'm wearing two of these. So let's drop those. Let's drop that. Let's drop those. Okay, now I can move. Oh, I'm like way down here. I thought I was up there. Okay. Let's go talk to my man. And trade with him. Now let's sell some things. Uh, let's sell that. Let's sell that. Let's sell the studded leather armor. Actually, keep that for now. Labor security card. I feel like that'd be important. Sell the scrap for now. And that. Okay. Offer. Yes. Okay, how much shit am I carrying now? 122 pounds. Okay. Also, I need to bind my all of my abilities, so this will be one. Oh no, this will be two, this will be three, this will be four, this will be five, six, seven. Okay. Okay. Alright, what you got, buddy? Same thing. Let's fucking go. Also, before I do this, do I have any weapons? I have a bronze dagger, and that's fucking it. Okay. So I'm gonna have to rely basically on like using my abilities essentially like full time. Which is fine. I'd like to see how this works. Gotta find the entrance. Are these apples? That's about a star apple tree. Can't take the star apples though. Okay, where is the entrance? It's gotta be around here somewhere. Here? Yeah, it's probably down here. Yeah, here it is. Okay. Let's go down. And I'm gonna fucking get wrecked again, probably. Okay, so first of all, abilities. Uh, but, 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 but I don't remember what these do. I thought. Toast? Okay, abilities, this is on three. So if I, like, do that... <laughs> I'm getting fucking wrecked. Um, disintegration? I killed myself. Or no, I didn't. I killed everything around me by disintegrating the fucking shit out of it. Let's do life drain. Interesting. Oh, shit. Uh, but just, just hit him, just hit him. I'm dead. <laughs> I probably should have picked... Okay, that's... Funky. Harvey Bird, man. Let's do it again. Space. Do that. Harvey Bird, man. Number three. <laughs> I was doing the best as Harvey Bird, man, and I'm going to continue to do the best as Harvey Bird, man. Because I can understand melee combat. I don't fucking understand anything else okay my guy give me your job I feel like this is a game that I should have like played a little bit first to understand like what the fuck is going on excuse me the fucking baboon hit me with a rock get the fuck in get in get in quick okay there's a chest it's got shotgun shells and a weird artifact so let's uh examine Poison Gas Grenade Mark 1. Let's equip. Let's take the shotgun shells and the copper nugget. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, there's a guy there. Let's just kill him. Alright, he's good. He's got a bronze two-handed sword. Does 1d6 of damage. Let's take it. Oh, I can't use the torch if I have... Oh... I feel like this game, once you get past the learning, it has a lot of potential. Yeah, I think it does. It's just a matter of, like, I don't... I understand how to play it, right? Like, you run around, you run into stuff, it dies, or you die. And I was doing pretty decent before. Oh, fuck. My man just shot me, like, four times in the face. But I got him, though. I have six health. <laughs> Um, let's take his painted bronze two-handed sword. Let's just get it. I don't want to equip it. Let's equip that. 
Let's take his furs. Let's look at my equipment. I have leather armor. And I have furs that do basically the same, but I think they give me a dodge. Oh shit. Uh, god, okay. Okay, okay, come on. There we go. Give me a dodge point. So let's equip. Let's check. Let me make sure that's how that works, okay? I have 5 dB now. If I unequip this and equip the leather armor, I have 6 dB. It subtracts my dodge value. Okay. That makes sense, actually. So let's make camp. Uh, one. I already have a camp nearby. Bullshit, I do. Trash. Oh, that's a bear. That's a bear. That's a bear. That's a bear. Run, my man. Run. Oh, I died. <laughs> Holy fuck. Alright. <laughs> Dude, this is fucked up. I need rep with bears. I should have been a gray beard, you're right. Alright, let's make a fucking gray beard. <laughs> Twenty three strength, twenty agility, twenty toughness, twenty four strength. Fuck the rest. I don't care. Space to choose mutations. We're gonna be a chimera. Uh, we're gonna do. Let's see. Double muscled. Nine square ray of flame. Get that one. And let's take uh, 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 night vision. Oh, I didn't need the torch because I can see in the dark. Duh. Let's take thick fur so we can get more reputation with bears. I remember. What was it? Hooks for feet. Can't wear shoes. Eat meat exclusively. Sharing hit points at 150 usual rate in the daylight. That's bad. Myopic. Nearsighted. You want to see radius up to 10. Don't know my health. Okay. I kind of want to get the uh, photosynthesis wherever it went. Oh, I can. Photosynthetic skin. Cool. All right. And it's the Greybeards that have the reps with bears, but they lose the strength. But that's okay, I have a shitload anyway, so... Okay, let's save this character. Oh god, um... Bear man. Bear man? Bear man, hell yeah, okay. Yep, go to Joppa, do the bear man. That's what we're doing. We're gonna we're gonna be we're gonna get reputation with bears. See how it goes. Okay. Yep. So now I'm a bear man. I need to fuck with my abilities. Can you name my next two? Yeah. Half man, half bear, half pig. Hey, I should have named myself man bear pig. Fuck you, right? But yeah, you can absolutely name my next guy. That's fine. Bask rate. Sure. I don't know what that does. Um, Search work. Do it. Let's key fucking ho. Let's go. Let's get the fuck in. What do I have for equip? First of all, I have a walking stick that does 1d2 of damage. I have ghostly flames? Interesting. <laughs> I guess it's because I'm a uh, fire boy. Excuse me, what the fuck are you? A hulking baboon. He's neutral toward me though, so that's good. He's not trying to kill me for once. Did I just spawn inside a fucking... Okay. Uh, take it all. Something critically hit me. And I didn't even have a chance to fucking retaliate. Go up. Go up. Get the hippity fuck out of there. Let's bask in the sunlight. <laughs> Holy fuck, that is not healthy down there. Not a great start, yeah, yeah, that's correct. Something is already, like, attacking- okay, it's this guy. He's dead. 
He has a battle axe on him. Uh, yep. Uh, get his stuff. Get his stuff. Get his stuff. Get his stuff. He has a battle axe. Let's take that. Let's equip that. Okay. Something else is attacking me. It is, um... Snapjaw Wardlord. Great. Okay, I got him. Desert Chris. Let's get the Chris. Let's get it. Wait, did I not take it? Get the Chris. Did he have two of them? Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. Did he have, did he have one? So what did I pick up? Oh, the stone. Fucking drop this shit. I don't need that. 1d3, 6 penetration. I have 6 penetration, 1d2 plus 1. So yeah, that's better. Okay, let's um, let's chill. What's the key mapping to just like chill until I'm healed? Tilled. Okay. No, that's not what I want to do. But it's fine. There are hostels nearby. Are you fucking serious? Flame ray. Flame ray is bitch ass. Go up, quick, go up, go up. <laughs> Am I bleeding? Is that what I'm, I'm like trailing blood everywhere? That's great. Rest until healed. <laughs> Jesus. I'm stuck. Uh, flame ray? I, I don't know what that did. I don't know what's going on. Berate. Hey, fuck you. Jesus. Pocketed vest. It's got one dodge rating and no armor. That's like the opposite of what I got. Oh my fucking god. There's so many things down here trying to kill me. Hold the fuck back up and just chill. Bask in the sunlight. Let's go. Alright. Okay. Not the best start in the world. Uh, Flame Ray. I think I... No, I killed him. I thought I hurt myself, too. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. It's two of them. But I got them both. Sick. <laughs> uh, Ron's short sword is 5 and 1d2. My axe is going to be better than that. But I don't even think I have any axe skill, probably. I have cudgel skill. Yeah, I have no axe skill at all. So I should probably be using, like, clubs. Right? Like... This guy's got a club on him. It's a 1d2 weapon. Let's equip. Can't equip items while stuck. Let's get it. And let's get unstuck. And let's equip this shit. I have a flaming fist that does 8 penetration, 1d2 minus 1. Would you consider playing Spooky's House of Jump Scares on stream? Fuck no, I will not consider playing Spooky's House of Jump Scares on stream. That's the. Jump Scares are like the, the fucking worst. It's fucked up because, like, half the... It's so cute, yeah, until you get to, like, the not-cute stuff. I know about that game. You can't trick me. I've seen Spooky's House of Jump Scares. There's some parts in it that ain't so cute. <laughs> it's Spooktober. Yeah, but I'm not... I don't like spooky things. Just beat them. Just beat them all to death. It's fine. Like, I was gonna play Killer7 tonight, and then I was like, nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I have no SP. Oh, because I didn't take any fucking. Wanna find something scary and have me play it? I like games where I can defend myself, though. That's the problem with most modern horror games, is you don't get to defend yourself. And I can equip this. And I can use my axe instead of using fucking Tuhu. Play Tuhu. Toho. Tuhu. I don't know. Why don't you say that word? Do I look like I speak Japanese? Scariest game series around? Yeah, probably. I mean, what's scarier than anime? What about weird artifacts? Oh, it's a painted one even. Okay. Let's examine. Bronze dagger with suspensors. Interesting. What's this one? 
flaming bro painted bronze long sword. Fuck yeah. But I can't really use long swords just yet. What do I need to get swords? A hundred points in long blade. A hundred points before I can get long blade. So that's like two levels. Let me check the chest now. Did I get a missile weapon at any point? No, I did not. Okay, there's a gold man. Please don't kill me. Okay, I got him. <laughs> I was worried for a second. Let's uh, just wait until we're healed. Oh god, there's two of them. Okay, I killed one of them, and I think the other one is still... Is this a fucking slime or something? It's a tar giant amoeba. Oh, it's dead now. Okay, flame ray. Get him. The tar is on fire, or was on fire. Let's, uh, let's get the bow. Do I have arrows for the bow, is the question. I just got a fucking bow. What do you mean I don't have anything? Take the bow. Literally. What the fuck? Oh, because I'm not pressing the right button, H. Get, okay. Now let's do it. Short bow. Do I have arrows? I do have arrows. Equip. There was a man in there. I saw him. He's burning. He's dead. Sick. Okay. Oh, there's there's a guy. I killed him. No, it's fine. I am out of arrows currently. It's fine. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Get. Uh, anything interesting? Cloth overalls could be good. Woven tunic. Let's take that. No, let's take this. Because that's... that's... Shit, let's remove this and equip the tunic. Because that'll give me some dodge value. Yeah. Okay. And let's get the artifact and the lens. Let's research that fucking artifact. I think I broke it. Aww. Okay. Alright, that's that's this floor basically cleared out. How am I doing on health? Or, okay, I'm quenched and sated, so we're good. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Let's go down. No, I wanna go down. I need to reload. Oh, shit. I fucking incinerated that guy. Okay. We're doing alright. Let's go up. <laughs> There's an amiibo and I want to heal my my abilities before I attack him. Okay, alright, so now the amiibo's on fire and is dead. Studded leather armor. Three to three armor value minus two dodge. But I have ten dodge, so I might want to worry about stacking dodge. Seems like a good idea. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gained a hit, I gained a level. Sick. Well, I got an attribute point. Um, let's go. Ooh, I only have one, right? So let's go. Intelligence. Yes. Okay. Scale cloth overalls. One and two. I have one and two, so it's the same thing, but we can take it. Okay. Okay, there's two men here. One of them instantly died. The other one's probably gonna be a bit okay, no, he's dead too. Another cap. Another apron. Do I have a head? No, I don't. So let's take that. Let's also equip it. 
A little bit more defense, not gonna hurt. I got an engraved beaded bracelet. Did I destroy that? What the fuck? Wooden arrows, let's take those, take the nugget. The fuck just happened? He cleaved through my armor. A pool of sugary blood. One dram of sugary blood. Interesting. Furs. Slender iron mace. Okay. What is a spider? Dead. I'm dead now. Okay, let's heal. I'm actually not doing too, too bad. Could be worse. 58 SP. I need 100 at least. I didn't even see that guy until he was already dead. Okay, there's a man there, but he should be fine, yeah. Okay, 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 we're good. Wish I could see a, like an indication of what my abilities do. That's not what I wanted to do, this was three. Um, it's like, I don't know what the rate does. Am I just like shouting like, you're fucking lame at them, I don't know. Okay, so there's men down there. There's a giant centipede. He's dead now. Okay. Oh, there's a bunch. Quickly. Retreat. Retreat and make my way down the hallway. Let's go. Heal my ass up. Okay. There's a bunch of them down here. Go back up. <laughs> We're gonna lame it out. Just lame it out, it's fine. Okay. Okay, got him. Bronze dagger. Uh, salt and crusted leather cap. Okay, alright. Alright, we're good, we're good. Everything's fine. Oh Jesus, okay. That man hit me like, he tried to hit me like three times. Okay, it's good. It's good. There's a guy there. It's cool. Yeah, my dodge is pretty pretty on point, looks like. Yeah, gain another level. Sick. Now I can learn long blade and use that flaming longsword. Fuck yeah. Uh long blade. Yes. Okay. Uh, I need to map aggressive stance to five. I need to equip that there long blade. Hell yeah, okay. Because the fire will probably do a fair amount of damage. Like, they're just dying. What the fuck are you? Albino ape? He's neutral. Okay. Something is shooting me. Oh, it's this man. He's dead now. Okay. We have an unburnt torch, which I can see in the dark, so the torches don't matter. Uh, iron battle axe, iron mace, and a copper nugget. I'll take the copper nugget. So, since the torches don't matter, can I, like, swing two weapons instead? Since it don't matter anyway? Since I can see in the dark? It looks like it. Sick. Oh, there's a lot there. Quick, back up. Back up. Great. Fuck you. You suck. Okay, I got him. Got him all. <laughs> it's a lot of blood. Something is shooting me. I don't know where it's coming from. It's right there. He's dead. Okay, heal quickly. Because <laughs> that was a lot of health I lost. Down. I seen you. Oh, Jesus. Did I step on like a spike? What the fuck? It's an ivory. Wait, what? Packed into packed into rings in the shale are spinescent shoots of blooming ivory. So it's just a stationary like enemy that can't really do anything besides just stand there and damage me. Okay, that's fine I suppose. This water. Okay. 
I want to start swimming. Okay, I need to back up. Flaming Kudzu dies. Okay, it's cool. What are you? Shale. The sh Why is the wall attacking me? Oh, it's stuff attached to the wall, I guess. It's wounded. Let's just lame it out for a second. Let's just have to find the critters. There's a bunch of them. Holy fuck. Dude, I'm gonna die. I need to get, I need to get, I need to get, I need to get, I need to go up the stairs, I need to get. Oh, he's fucking following me. I killed him! <laughs> Quick heal. <laughs> Let me get his corpse. Okay, let's go down. Okay. Okay, I think we're fine. There was another one. Okay, there he is. Bear Man's doing well. Yeah, he is. I'm pleasantly surprised at how well he's doing. Got him. Okay. There's got to be more than that, right? Because I have to... Oh, I have to return with it. Okay, I'm good. Let's get the fuck out. Oh, shit. I leveled up. Genome enters an excited state. Would you like to spend four mutation points? To buy a mutation before rapidly mutating. Hell yeah, I would. Okay, so I can get sleep gas generation, where I can burst sleep gas around myself. Not bad. I can get two hearted, two toughness, and I can sprint for 30% longer, which I haven't sprinted yet, so it's not a big deal. Or carapace, which I lose two dodge value. I gain three armor value. I can't wear armor. Let's get the sleep gas. <laughs> Mutation to rapidly advance. Uh, double muscle? Okay. So, what exactly does that do for me? This rank is plus three strength and 19% chance to daze opponent. Okay. Okay, 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 I see. Let's go up. I actually get to complete this quest, maybe. If I don't just get fucking murdered on the way out. Uh, which way is the stairs? Is it this way? Yes, it is. Go up. Now, quick, go back to town. Where am I? There you go. Go back to town. Go into town and tell the man I did the thing. Bring the corpse to Elder Iridad's hut. Okay. So can I... That's just a door. Okay. His hut's gotta be somewhere. Is it this one? Is this the Elder? Yes, it is. Okay. So, I came back with Spiderling. It's a Gershling. What's a Gershling? Infernal creature of plague, but not for a millennium. Is why now? Seat Wayfarer, 1,000 years ago, in the last days of the Sultanate, a series of seven plagues called the Gyre spread throughout, or spread through and out of Cud. It was a long stewing punishment for some trespass committed by the, in the soft sludge of Primordium before the Sultans reigned. Okay. Scourge of Gershlings is one of these plagues, but Reshef lifted the curse, he cast, cast off his crown, and unmade the Sultanate. It makes no sense that the Gershlings would return to eat crops unless what dark tiding this is. It was a rabid, black-robed figure with the Gershling. It was a glow white, no doubt. This maniacal fools worship the Gersh Nephilim as gods. What the fuck is a Gersh Nephilim? The seventh plague. Demons born on the moon stair, quickened to life for the purpose of eating our young. Your chef cast them back before, but if they returned, bear man. Your discovery is invaluable to us. We are poor farmers, and sharpen our vine reapers is all we can do. There may be others outside of Joppa who can do more. Take these prickly boons as thanks. I will not soon forget your service to us, Bear Man. Please leave me now to muse on this. Okay. Gave an, gave, receive an Uber Nostrum Injector, a weird artifact, a Sav Injector, a Sav Injector, and a Sav Injector. 
Okay. I my reputation has increased by 200 to 60. Neat. I see. Let's trade. Here, take some of my shit. Uh, offer. Oh shit! No, I wanted to do this. Take that. Take this. Uh, can't really do anything with the broken artifact. Take the corpse. Uh, take the kudzu stems. You can have these unburnt ass torches. You can have this, 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 this. Why did I have a? Ch I took the chest. No, I want to see what's in the chest before I give him the chest. This and this. He's gonna give me a shit for water for this. Okay. So in my in my inventory, I have a chest. So let's open the chest. Oh, there's a book in here. Take all. Here. Open. No. What is this book? Read. Oh, this is like a full-on ass book. I ain't fixing to read all this on stream. Fuck no. That's cool, though. It's not about to be fucking story time with, with Badical here. Uh, let's trade. Here, you can have the book. No, I need to know about the right of myth. But here's what you do, right? Game is thirteen dollars and forty nine cents on GOG right now. Take thirteen dollars and forty nine cents. Go buy it. Find the book and read it. <laughs> Let's trade, so I can sell him the book. Offer. Now, god damn it. Take the book, or Google it. Yeah, or Google it. That works too. For all that yeah so what does he have i don't have a lot of money so it doesn't really matter what he has but it could be interesting to see he's got a rifle i can't afford it but he's got a rifle what if i what if i just like ask for it he needs 357 drams to get that okay yeah so you got a link there you go perfect <laughs> Go read it. Tell me if it's interesting. Really sleep gassed all off. Let's uh, name it a seven. Okay, sprint. We can go fast. Take a sip of fresh water. Okay, so I don't have any quests. What does he want me to do? Tell me about the Gershons and the Geyer. Okay. Okay, whatever. Alright, so I guess now we're kind of just like up to our own. Was that a cat? I start to glow. A ray cat crossed the marshy well and wandered into Joppa. It's phosphorescent. Interesting. A phosphorescent cat. Drink. Okay. So I guess now it's just kind of up to us to do kind of fucking whatever. So, let's go up to the world map and see. The glow dims until it's extinguished. Okay. Okay. You know, there's some ruins nearby. Would you like to investigate? Sure. You discover Bipir. That's the location of Bipir and locations ruin section of your journal. Okay. Why do I have a feeling I'm about to get, like, fucking myrtleized in here. Something is happening down here. Because I see things like exploding. Arc sconce. Okay. Oh, it's a bear. No, friend. We're supposed to be friends. How could you? Is a fire bear? Flaming bear. I'm sorry, Bear, but you started it, to be fair. Oh, there's like a shitload of centipedes. And then if I hit, come over here and hit seven and release sleep gas and just like let them be asleep. 
And then I just do it again. <laughs> it's just like put him to sleep and set him on fire. Did that do it? Please tell me that wasn't like a beehive. That was a centipede nest. Quick, kill the centipedes. Jesus, there's so many fucking centipedes. Well, I leveled up, so I guess I killed them. I have 140 SP. Um, improved aggressive stance. Persuasion, wayfaring. What's, what's this got? Menacing stare. I need more ego for that. Make camp. I don't have enough intelligence to do any of that. Jesus, okay. First aid probably would be good. Staunch wounds, activated non-combat only. Use a bandage, instantly cure any bleeding effects. Okay. So this is like throwing and okay okay endurance what you got shake it off each round your days with the sun you have a toughness minus 10 percent chance to shake off the effect you also take 25 less 25 percent less damage from poison okay poison tolerance could be good to have. Uh, I think I'll just hold on to my points for now, though. And then I did get... I didn't get any attribute points. What is, like, what is all this? Sleep gas. It's just sleep gas just hanging out. Okay, well, that's good. Gotta be real careful about where I go around here. What is this? Water vine. I don't like how the game is chanting at me right now. Gra graffiti foam create. You are skilled with crushing and bludgeoning weapons. Okay. What is that? Wet glow pad. Okay. Alright. Alright, well this is not leading me anywhere. Let's go. Let's go this way. You wilted. I need sunlight to bask in. How do I wait till day? What button is that? Wait until morning is control until. Because I need to be daytime so I can bask. Okay. How's my health and still my. Okay, I'm quenched and sated. Listen, I don't need elephant noises in my ear. This game's got a really good soundtrack. It's very atmospheric. This is a bedroll. Oh, I can just like sleep. Sick. Can I pick it up? I can. I have a bedroll. What's in here? Nothing. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. There's like a room down there. It's got like a pot in it. No door though. Maybe it's like a pillar. Actually, maybe not be a pot. Ooh. Graffiti foam creek says, "We believe they're. We believe they're. Was that rattling? Unless dependent on your intelligence score." Okay. What's in here? Nothing. You pass by a water vine, Foshwomet's Icy Cannon. What the fuck is Foshwomet's Icy Cannon? Get the. Yo, hold up. No, I want to know. There's a chest. Open the chest. There's nothing in there. Fuck. Oh, there's guys. There's a guy. What is this? An EMP miner? Okay. Stilt pistons fire at an alternating quattro and tote the, the miner and her mines in esoteric patterns across the ground. 
when her topographic instincts are sated, the hatch opens and she lays her explosive egg. Come back. I ain't done with you. Come back. Oh, she blew up. No, she didn't. Where did it go? Oh, it's like over there. Burn, bitch. Okay, well, I killed the EMP miner, I assume. Interesting. I think that was a robot, so I don't think doing sleep gas would have done anything for me. So another light. Can I take the light? No, I can't take the light, of course. Oh, what is this? Shrine to Reshef, Ghost in Cerulean. That was the guy that we heard about earlier. Shrine depicts a significant event from the life of ancient Sultan Reshef. In 3BR, Rekaba, Rebecca, no, Rekaba, Rebecca betrayed Reshef by stealing the Mark of Death from the gate to the Tomb of the Eaters. In punishment, Reshef excommunicated her from the Sultanate. Interesting. Let's pray. You voice a short prayer beneath the shrine to Reshef, Ghost, and Cerulean. You place this piece of information in the Sultan History's Reshef section of your journal. Interesting. There's just a fence. Okay. So there's still up here to explore. Okay, no, it just slips me back around. Interesting. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this. Let's go up. There's some ruins. Let's go into the ruins. What is this more graffiti shit? No, it's shale. Oh, that's a wall. It's dead now. What are you? Dogthorn tree? No. Arcanaut. Okay. His club bulges around his waist where he stashes scrap on his belt. He doesn't look at you, but two steps in front of you. He's got... He's got a bunch of stuff equipped. He's got a revolver equipped. Can I talk to him? I can. Okay. Interesting. Oh, fuck. My laptop broke as hot as fuck. I burned my foot on that. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. It's a giant amoeba. It's on fire now. It's dead now. That was another one. Okay. It only took one damage shooting. That's not too bad. Interesting. So there's just a guy here. Another bedroll. Oh, there's a fucking wall. Can I bask? Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. Pass by a rusted archway. Pass by some flower fields. You've lo you're lost. Regain your bearings by exploring your surroundings. Who the fuck are you? Forager, forager, stalker. So there's a bunch of dudes. Oh, Jesus. Oh, he threw like a fucking, like, bomb at me. I'm dead. <laughs> I was doing so good. Oh, well. Oh, I had a fucking EMP grenade the whole time. It wouldn't have done me anything, though. I was doing so good, too. Oh, well. Okay. Um, let's see. New character. Mutated. I like... Accuracy with both melee and ranged weapons. Yeah, I like being strong. But I also want to be able to get more skill points. So let's make sure we boost that up some. Okay. Choose mutations, morphotypes, doesn't really matter. Uh, I do want double muscled. Shit. No, 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 no. Shit. Come on. I do want double muscled. I do want. Flame Ray was pretty good. Freeze Ray would probably be good too. Interesting. 
corrosive gas, electrical generation, EMP pulse. Can wear fucking oh, horns. Multiple arms, multiple legs. See in the dark, that one's pretty good to have. Photosynthetic skin I like. The sleep gas is pretty good. You get to do the name? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know what I want for like a... Like a... a I guess freeze ray? Let's do freeze ray. Let's do a beak. So we're gonna be a person with a beak and a freeze ray. Let's see if customize. Oh, oh, I get to just pick. Oh, interesting. I like beak though. You can customize the freeze ray. Oh, I can emit it from my hands, face, or feet. Oh, that's cool. I'll do it from hands is fine. That's neat. I didn't even realize. Okay, so for this guy, I like the idea of doing a gunslinger. But also, I want to be able to attack with, like, um, not guns, melee weapons, that's the word. Yeah, Spare Man died. I, uh, I got mobbed by a bunch of, like, fucking, uh, bandits, basically. Like, like, ten of them. And I tried to hit him with the sleep gas, but they just, they just swarmed me. It sucked. Uh, you know, fuck it, I'm gonna do Gunslinger. Okay, Gunslinger with a beak and freeze ray. No, but I'm taking double muscle, though, like, you know, it's too late now. Um... I'm gonna be a strong gunslinger with a freeze ray. Al Gore, okay, all right. So let's go here, Al Gore. <laughs> I guess it would have been better if I was playing as a, a bear man, pig, man bear pig, but I'm playing as a shoot man. Okay, so now I need to bind freeze ray to two. I'm gonna bask. So now we gotta go through the process of doing this quest again. So let's try it. Alright, what do I have equipped? I have two revolvers with lead slugs. And I have icy vapor from my hands. You're saying you should be Dick Cheney then? Well, I don't have a shotgun, I have revolvers, so it'll be fine. Also, it's too late now. So I basically, all I can do is shoot guns. Okay, that's fine. Let's go to the map. We're gonna go up to this shit again. And go down. Hopefully I will not just immediately get fucking myrtleized. Um, so, I have two guns, but I can't even do a Kimbo yet. Okay, great. I want to get a melee proficiency, like, ASAP. Because... I need to be able to hit things when they're close to me. <laughs> and I have a beak, so I'll sometimes peck them also. I guess. Like, that works. I got stairs, gotta be- there we go. Stairs! Would you like to walk the nearest stairway down? No. Okay, so there's already... Oh, that's me. Okay, who's this? Snapjaw Brute. So, fucking shoot him. He's dead. Oh, there's a bunch of them. He's dead, okay. Okay. Iron Mace, Dagger. Let's take his fair skin gloves and equip them. Uh, 5 penetration, 2 health damage. First of all, let's kill him. Um, okay, so... I like the idea of running with the dagger. 5 and 1d2. So we'll take that, we'll equip it. I have... 
Okay, I'm doing okay. How's my dodge value? 11. Shit. Okay. I need to reload. Oh, I reloaded. Okay. Quilted shawl. Shaw. Get. I don't want to wear it because I don't want my dodge value to go down any. And I am hungry. Okay. Gunslinger's pretty cool, not gonna lie. I am gonna take a short bow, just cause, like... How many bullets? I have 32 bullets. I started with 44, so, like... I need to... Oh, shit. The bat's attacking me? The bat's usually friendly. Well, he's dead now, fuck. Uh, let's just take everything. I did take everything, okay. So they take everything, right? Let's go down. I'm missing every time I shoot. Okay, there we go. He's got black robes, a short sword, and I will take the lion wafer. We're gonna take those arrows. Congealed blaze? What the fuck is congealed blaze? Adds heat and fire-based effects to cooked meals. Okay. We'll take the copper nugget. I'll take the water skin. That's got salt water in it, though, so we need to be careful not to... Excuse me? Flaming water skin with one dram of slime. Okay. Well, it's on fire. Not a lot I can do about it. Excuse me, what the fuck did my thing just save me? My tablet just popped up a bunch of bullshit on the top. That was weird. Okay. Oh god. I leveled up. I thought I died. They kind of scared me for a second. <laughs> Sling and run. Receive no accuracy penalties from firing, firing pistols while running. Uh, I could take. I want the short blades. So let's. I like collapse some of these because like. This is a lot of shit that's open. Short blade. Yes. We want short blades. Yes. Okay, good. We can use daggers as a backup. 16 points remaining. Uh, let's minimize axe. Let's just minimize basically everything that I'm not going to be working with. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Alright. So. And then I leveled up and I got one mutation point. Okay, he dead. So I have equipped bronze dagger. Okay, should I put? I should find another bronze dagger and put it in my other hand. We need dual wield bronze daggers. So as soon as I see somebody with oh shit, okay, need a long sword. Something oh it's spider web that was like a spooky ghost up there. I need to reload. Quick. Ah. 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 It's fine. I just assumed R was reload and it was. It happened to work out perfectly. Leather cap. Could be good to have. What do I have equipped in my head? Nothing. Well, let's equip that leather cap. Then. Oh shit. Okay, I'm still fine. He has another bronze dagger. Let's get it equipped. Okay, well it didn't equip it, it unequipped my other shit. Let's get let's get the overalls, because it might be Yeah, it's better than my tunic. Okay, and then my right hand has a torch. I don't need that shit because I'm not using I'm, I can see in the dark. So let's remove and equip the other bronze dagger. I have two bronze daggers and two revolvers. We're about to fuck some shit up. Okay. How many bullets do I have? 20. Man, being a gunslinger is cool, but I don't have shit for, for ammo to start with. But I can get these arrows, and I'll have a bow, so at least I can do that.
Okay, there's there's mans in here. Wait, don't I have a fucking freeze ray? Yes, I do. It just like annihilated the one guy. It's a little spider. Oh, he's upset. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. <laughs> Let's heal. Okay. 82 SP. Sling and run. No accuracy penalties requiring because I want to get a Kimbo. Fuck him up, Al Gore, hell yeah. And I got uh, an attribute point, so let's put that into intelligence. Yes. Because I want more skill points whenever I do things. Okay, alright, back up, back up. Sprint and fucking run. I need to reload. Oh god. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. He also had a quilted shaw. Let's fucking take it. I can sell that shit for money. I have eight bullets. I should probably save some of my bullets for the, the fucking bugs. Oh, he has an iron dagger. That's a 1d3. That. Let's equip that shit. My left hand. My right hand is going to be my primary. So let's remove this and then equip the iron dagger. Okay. And then it worst comes to worse, I have a bow, right? Like I'm not crazy. I did pick up a bow. Yes, I did. Okay. So long sword. Let's go down. Okay, so there's problems already. There's a shale, which is got a thing in it and there's a cave spider and centipedes and a lot of centipedes let's go up quickly the centipedes are following me the centipedes have died okay I think we're good let's heal and let's go down okay that's good Ooh, there's two chests here wooden arrows weird artifact uh, bandage. A tunic. There's a fucking another centipede. I leveled up again. Hell yeah. We're gonna get a Kimbo. That was what I had been looking for. I'm leveling up pretty quick. Uh, what was I gonna do? X. What the fuck was I doing? Oh, the artifact, right. Uh, exam. Freeze grenade. Let's fucking put that shit. Hell yeah. All right, let's go. Oh, it was, oh, there's like traps. I'm bleeding. Oh, sick lead slugs. Hell yeah, I need those. Okay, all right, all right, freezer A. You should be frozen. Just stab him a bunch. Oh, there's a centipede. He's dead. It's fine. Quick, heal. <laughs> okay. Alright, we good. We good. Everything's fine. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Everything's fine. Alright, yeah, it's, it's all good. Oh, there's a chest. Bark armor. Small rosy tube. What is this? Well, puzzling artifact. Get? Does it count as an artifact? It does. Examine? Whole cunning injector. Oh, okay. So, what does this effect now? Active effect. Okay, it gives me plus six strength, minus, or plus two temporary hit points per level, minus 25 move speed. Can't feel pain, immune to fear, suffer 1% of maximum hit points and damage each round. It can't reduce me below one hit point. Okay, good to know. If I'm into drug. What was I scared of? I'm fleeing from a dread root. Okay. Found the critters. Oh jeez, there's so much going on. Got him. Take his corpse. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay. Mutation. Can cause plants to hinder enemies. I can sunder mines, or I can grow a carapace. Good 
gonna get the plants and we're gonna level up the freezer eh? and then we're gonna get the fuck out of here because we did the quest so let's fucking go uh, back up yes okay save again yes we're gonna walk to the nearest stairway that's convenient what the fuck are you? Like a crab? A horned chameleon? Okay, I guess he's dead. <laughs> Let's go up. There are hostels nearby. What the fucking hostels? There ain't no hostels. It's good. Here, man. I got it. Yeah, I got it. Well, let's go give this to the man. Okay, I got the stuff again. Did it again. Alright. Save. Oh, I have to save and quit. I can't just, like, save the game. Okay. Good to know. Let's talk to this guy. Trade with him. Let's trade off our bark armor. These woven tunics. The cloak shaws. Bearsling corpse. Let's give him the blaze. Give him the torches. Uh, we'll give him the one bronze dagger. Copper nuggets. And that's it. So, offer? Yes. Okay. And he sells lead slugs, so let's buy as many of those as we can. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. How much fresh water do I have? 64 plus 8 is 72 drams. Okay, not too bad. Alright, so now we're pretty much back where we were, minus a level. So, I have 80 SP. I could train in... this tactics got? Oh, I didn't want to, like, get all of them. Those tactics got hurdle. No penalty to my DV when I sprint. Deft throwing. Throw range increased by three and throw variance is halved. Okay, that could be good because I have a throwing thing. I have a freeze gas grenade. Uh, we probably should train bow and rifle at some point. So let's, let's work toward that. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna... I'm lost. Oh, Jesus, I'm lost again. I should just go this way. And then go up. Yo, shit is, like, fucked up. I don't know where I am. I'm lost. Oh, Jesus. I don't... I have no... Okay, there we go. I have no earthly fucking idea where I am, but this was bad last time I got lost, because I fucking died. I'm gonna follow what appears to be this road. Wherever it leads. Just go. I hope there are no enemies on my ass when I try to go. Are these like bricks? What are these? Blowfish. It's a bridge. Oh, it's a bridge. Okay. There's some stuff going on up there. I don't know how I feel about all that. I'm just gonna... Oh, something's coming for me. Sprint. Fucking run, boy. Oh, I, I got myself stuck. I died. Fucking shit. Damn it. <laughs> all because I got fucking lost. Uh. <laughs> Alright, well... Let's uh, let's pop this up. I'm gonna I'm gonna hop off. I think. Let me put some music on. That game is fun, like real fun. Al Gore, no. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I got lost. It sucked. I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna hop off. I'm gonna let's see. It's a little after seven thirty. I need to check on my work stuff. Let's see. It's still going. Okay. But yeah, no, this was fun.
He never had a chance to invent the internet. <laughs> he never had a chance to star in that one episode of South Park. Um, but yeah, no, this was fun. The game is actually really fun. And I feel like if I can get past the just general kind of like bullshit of hey you got lost and we're just gonna kill you because you gotta kind of run around and find your bearings and like i don't fucking know what i'm doing i think there's a mutation i can take or maybe it was a cybernetic thing i could take where i, I won't get lost anymore and that might be something worth looking into because i don't want to keep getting lost and dying it kind of sucks but yeah i guess we'll figure that out next time i play this which will be sometime i don't know uh tomorrow i don't know what i'm gonna do i don't i don't really feel like playing killer seven like i want to play it but also like i don't feel like it either um find a spooky game to try to get me to play good luck i don't play spooky shit but dead space maybe but i don't know i i think i remember the pc version of dead space being kind of ass so i'll have to look into it and see but yeah, uh, hopefully the mic sounded okay. Like I said, I, I had to fiddle around with it for a bit, and it's sitting kind of like, say, oh, um, become RuneScape. Mic sounds fine. VR with you. I'm glad the mic sounds good because, like I said, I've been I was fucking with this thing for like an hour and a half trying to get it to like good levels. Um, VR with you. Yeah, we could do that. I don't, I can't, I don't know if I can stream that on Twitch though, because like, without plugging it into my laptop, and I feel like my laptop would catch fire if I did that. Because like, anytime I plug the headset into my laptop, it just like immediately spikes my temps. Which, if I wasn't streaming, I wouldn't be worried about. Well, we could VR casually. Yeah, no, we could. We need to play VR chat at some point. Run around as buff Pikachu and buff Goose or whatever the fuck and just like flip people off. I don't know. Um, I'm trying to think of when I'm free, cause like work tomorrow, Saturday I've got a party, Sunday I'm gonna stream again, probably World of Warcraft. I'll probably do WoW on Sundays, cause it's a pretty good way to like start or end the week, I guess. It's just something chill. But yeah, no, uh, I could probably take tomorrow off do some vr stuff tomorrow because not tomorrow off work tomorrow off streaming because like i don't even know what i want to play tomorrow so maybe we'll do that i don't know either that or maybe something like skyrim or we might play this again i don't know we'll see uh if i'm not on by like 5 30 tomorrow like you'll know just hit me up we'll be talking on discord anyway it's fine but yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna skit Y'all have a good night, and I will see you next time. Thanks, y'all.